quick dev tip. Did you know that you can combine multiple static mesh actors in your level into a new single static mesh actor? So this is really useful if you're going to be using the same things again and again. So here in my example, I've got a street light I made out of three separate static mesh actors just from here. We can make things easier on ourselves by selecting the three of them, right click, grouping, and then we can move it around like this. However, this is still a bit messy as it's still the three parts and it's also a group. A better way to do this and a, the way I want to show you today in today's quick dev tip is to select your static mesh actors, right click, go to confer actors to static mesh. It's going to ask you where you want to put them. Give it a name, give it a save. Now if I go to my folder, you can see we've got a new static mesh actor. So cool thing is now I can just place this around and the good thing about this is it's just one asset. So it's a lot cleaner here. One of the downsides to this is that it won't merge similar material IDs, but it's not really a problem because you could right click asset actions, export, export it out, make the change in your 3D program, re-import it over the top. So the UI is a little bit different, but in the Unreal 5 Early Access Edition, it seems to work in exactly the same way. Select the meshes, right click, convert actors to static mesh, choose a file name, save it, there you go, copy it around. So like I've used this before and I'd use it again for helping block out. If I'm blocking out a scene and I get some shapes that I really like, or for example, a staircase uh, made of primitives, I'll turn it into one mesh and then I'll copy it around and really help speed up my workflow.